Good afternoon, Mr. Hutchinson. Oh, hi, Kuni. Good afternoon. Uh, coming in, please. Thank you for having me today. Before everything, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Kuni. So I am from the REAA agency. I have a five years experience in the industry, especially in your area. The last month, our agent we already saw five different properties in your suburb, and one of them is record um, with the highest price. And we are managing about like twenty different property in the area. So today, I would like to come and have a more understanding about your needs and one and the condition of the property. So please show me the house. Certainly. Um. So further from our discussion on uh, the other day, um, well, and since my wife already passed away in the past few years, so um, I definitely will move to the retired village. Um, however, of course, I will need you to provide me more information about both um, the selling and the rental market, so I can make my decision. Um, so let's see my house a bit, and um, also it, with all of the information I provided to you in our first meeting, um, let's see um, how you can see my house, um, okay? And uh, all right, so after seeing my house, how much do you think that my property would worth for selling now? Okay, just um just going around first, and then like uh, I will mean, uh, have a like um thoroughly um like the the house tour for your house so that I can give you the exact price. Okay. Um, do you have any like specific area that you think is like the standout for the house that you want to let me know? Um. Well, I think. Um my like one of the precious um you know areas in my house that i really love is actually the living area and um, the kitchen and as you can see it's quite big and um, quite comfortable with uh, you know all of the uh, this environment with the uh, ventilation and everything with a lot of like windows and you can see the air the, the feeling the vibe and everything like for the family, very wet for the family, yeah. So, and uh, of course, and other features of the house also pieces and outstanding, like as I discussed, also as you can see. Um, but but let let tell me about your your like your opinion then. Mm. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, absolutely, I agree with you, like, uh, when I stand, like, I, when I come in your house, the living area is, um, like, one of the areas that I really love in your house, that, um, I really agree with you, mm -hmm. the vibe and everything, um, and, like, uh, all the air coming through the house, it makes the temperature of the house is cooler than the outside, mm -hmm. I really love it too, um, and also, so, this is the report like the appraisal report that I have prepared for you just mm -hmm. go through it mm -hmm. um, I have done the research to compare job property with um, and this is the um, property appraisal including the both information for rental and sell the property now is worth between 930,000 to 980,000 I see I see oh quite surprising and I'm quite happy with the price um, and do you know why all of a sudden the price has gone up quite a lot because I can see it's quite you know going and increasing a lot the price has went up because like several impact including like the demand definitely uh, has to be higher than before as you see now the population of your area has grown quite like much more like different than 10 years ago or five years ago <laughs> um other e like seeing the properties in sydney um has uh, dramatically increased uh for the last few years and a lot of people i think now even investor or the like people they want to have a like stable life 
they um, can't afford more with the price is in the main like CBD area in Sydney. That's why they are moving now, starting looking for the different location and the spreading the location growth in your area. And um, as you can see now, like uh, even with the rental markets, it's not like before. Uh, seen a lot of people like the work of a mining industry, they start uh, looking for the um, the residential area like in order to stay for a long term too. Hmm. Okay. This that's true. Um. How about the rental return? Um. Along with the increase of the population, definitely the demand will become higher too. But the percentage of the home homeowner in our um in our area is much higher than the investor. As a result, the rental return can't um like cannot be low at the moment. We can get the tenant pay in between like seven hundred and twenty to seven fifty for you. And as I has been mentioned before, since like um before like five years ago, normally like you can see home uh, owner the percentage of home, home uh, owner in the area is much higher than investors so uh, and now seeing the demand of the rental in uh, markets has grown so less how um, in the rental market that's why the price is quite high comparing to before the like demand very high and the supply doesn't have much mm -hmm. so what is your commission to manage the property uh, we charge 7.7% .7 including GST, which I believe that's it already like the standard fees uh, of the most agency in the area already. Um, if like if you're going around and asking uh, for like the appraisal of the price, they will definitely tell you that range. Uh, are you negotiable on your commission or? Um, According to our company policy, if you have one property with us for leasing, we will charge you the standard fee as I mentioned before, 7.7%. .7%. But obviously, if you have at least like three properties with us, we can offer you the minimum management fee of 6% including GST. Our company would like to grow the business along with the growing the relationship uh, with all our landlords. So we always concern the service that we deliver to all the clients, such as we will make sure like all the email and the request from the client will be responded in 48 hours. I see. Um, so what kinds of services do you offer as part of the management of the property? With our team, communication has been considered as one of the most important aspects that we will highly pay attention to. Um, since we are like the middle party, we can communicate both um, between the like tenant and the landlord. So our role is vital to attend any request from both owner and tenant as soon as possible. Per year, we will conduct like at least two routine inspections in order to check up how the tenant keeps the property. Moreover, if there is any repairs that need to be attended, with our experience, we will identify whether the landlord or the tenant will be the one uh, be responsible for it. For example, if the toilet block got like the toilet got blockage. The plumber we send out will assist us to check um, and see if the issue caused by the tenant or uh, or not like the like the excessive view of the toilet paper. Uh, you know, some of my friends who have uh, like investment properties have told me that sometimes you might have to deal with the tenant who is owing money. Can you please explain to me what should we do in that situation? Normally, we will keep you posted when the tenant starting being in arrears after like four days, and we will allow to issue the notice of termination. And if they keep not paying the rent, and we will eligible um, to apply for the tribunal, it will cost you the application fee of like around like fifty two dollar. 
and the, our attendance fees will be $110. The outcome can be no eviction. The eviction order is not guaranteed, but we uh, it can lead to the payment plan and ten, tenant will understand how the serious the matter is. So in order to minimize the risk of having the bad tenants, we normally advise our owner to buy the landlord insurance. How much is a yearly landlord insurance as you just mentioned? When will and when will you need to comp like claim the insurance? Uh, it's going to be like uh, from around like uh, 450 to 520. It depends on like which company that you want to go with. Um, uh, and then we will need to do the claim of the insurance when the tenant arrears or the repair cost being responsible by the tenant are existing with the bond. For example, like the bond only 2000 but the repair or the arrear is more than 2000 like three or 4000 That's when uh, we can like claiming the insurance. Um, except the like access fee, you need also need to pay for our fee of the preparing for the paperwork and normally it's been cost around like $110 too. I see. So thank you for all the details possible. And I also want to know how you guys going to advertise my properties too. We will choose advertise in the realestate.com domain which are the most uh, like two popular websites that we will leave the art in our and also we will leave the um, art in our digital board at our windows uh, so it will get attention from anyone going uh, past and interested in is the advertising cost included in the commission the advertising fees will be covered in our letting fees, so one week of the rent plus with GST. For example, if your rent is $500 and then the, the letting fee will be $550, which um, which not only the fee that we pay for all the art, but it also the time that we need the spending in order to show the property as well. Clearly understand that. Um, I think I'm very Please with all of the services that your like you guys uh, will provide if you are the one who manage my property and I probably will decide to keep my property for rental instead of selling it. So yeah, I think so, yeah. So here's a manager uh, management agreement. All the information that I basically already summarized for you. Um, please go through it one more time and if you have any further question let me know here we go okay let me just read it a little bit oh and also I just like come up with uh, a question too um, uh, with the so with the rental um like can you please let me know like normally how long it will take you know like approximately from now until that i can get a tenant like you know to rent the house like how long it will take normally um so normally obviously i can't guarantee uh how long we can get the tenant for you um, but definitely we will try our best in order to process and everything like as um, soon as possible in order to try to get the tenant in the earliest as, um, convenience that we can for you uh, and also because like we got that very like high database of the list of the people looking for the house in the areas so um, what I can do is right after when we advertising Chapopti I will call up our database uh, and asking if anyone uh, interested in and we can write after that like um, showing the property for them but I wouldn't expect uh, long like that too long maybe it's going to be I hope I can find the tenant for you in one or two weeks. Uh, I I didn't actually ask you. So you saying the the rental will be around seven hundred twenty to seven hundred fifty. Um, is there any chance that we can try to you know to do it like 
the highest one as possible. Oh, definitely. That should be okay. So the, I can try with the highest case price for you, and then after that, like um, if um, for example, like if after one week we didn't see any interest from the people, no inquiries, I will approach it to you. I will I'll show you. So this is the outcome um report that we got from the real estate. Uh, and it's all up to you. If you still happy to try for another week, we more than happy to have you to try with the highest price. And uh, if you change your mind, you want to reduce the price a little bit in order to get more attention and more interest for your property, we uh, we will like can adjust the price in our app right after. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Uh, yeah. So the paperwork here is all done. Here we go. Thank you for trusting our service. Before advertising your property, I will need to arrange a day to come and take a picture for your property. Right, I will be at home only this Wednesday, so you can come anytime. Okay, just let me double check my calendar to see. Um, can I come at 10 a.m. in the morning? Fine, totally fine. Thank you for having me today. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact with me. Sure, and see you on Wednesday. See you then.